Victoria College is one of the seven colleges that makes up the Faculty of Arts and Science here at the University of Toronto. With over 28,000 undergrads that make up the faculty, only 3,500 of those students belong to Victoria College. Vic was founded in 1836 in Coburg, Ontario as Upper Canada Academy. At the end of the 19th century, Vic joined U of T and has been here ever since. As a Vic student, you get the best of both worlds. The advantages of being at Victoria University as well as all the broader advantages and resources of being at the University of Toronto. E.J. Pratt Library is home to over 300,000 collections here at Victoria College. This is definitely my one-stop shop for all my library needs. Especially if you're living on residence, it's so much easier just to come to E.J. Pratt a couple steps away from your residence room. Welcome to Burwash Dining Hall. This is the main dining hall at Vic's campus. It's open every day from 7.30 a.m. till about 7 p.m. and they do breakfast, lunch, and dinner. There's a three-week rotating menu, so every day there's different hot entrees, salads, soups, pizzas, sandwiches, desserts. You can choose a large or small meal plan depending on your appetite. They also offer services like to-go lunches, so if you know you're not going to be on campus for the day, you can request a lunch the day before and then just pick it up and go. There's also study space during midterms and exams. They're open from 9 p.m. to 1 or 6 a.m. There's free coffee and it's just a safe, nice place to study all night. The Gold Ring Centre is the hub of Vic student life. It has two student lounges, our student union's office, alumni affairs, the dean's office, as well as club space. Ned's Cafe is more grab-and-go style food options, so sandwiches, soups, salads. It's also a really popular study spot or place to grab a coffee before class. Welcome to the Cat's Eye Student Pub and Lounge. It's run by students and hosts things like plays, open mic nights and concerts. There's a games room in the back and it's generally just where everybody hangs out. Built in 1931, Lower Burwash is conveniently located just a few steps away from Museum Station. A great way to see the rest of downtown Toronto. Lower Burwash has four houses, Ryerson, Nels, Caven, and BG, and is also home to the Vic One Living Learning Community. Each house has their own common room, it has a TV, DVD player and cable, and laundry is in the basement. This is a double room in Lower Burwash. You have the main room here with one bed, and then the second bed is located in the alcove. You share a semi-private bathroom with the room next door. This is Upper Burwash. It's divided into four houses. North, middle, south, and gate. It looks out onto the quad and is over 100 years old. Here at Upper Burwash, the residences are co-ed. Students are encouraged to decorate them as they please. And all residence rooms come with desks, beds, and of course, wardrobe space. The common rooms here at Upper Burwash are equipped with kitchens and cable TV. They provide a great environment for students to hang out and to enjoy each other's company. Margaret Addison houses our residence desk and security services. It's open 24 hours a day. Margaret Addison has a fantastic social scene. This co-ed residence has rooms available in single or double rooms. Every residence at Victoria College has a Don, which are upper year students who provide guidance and support for new and returning students at Vic. Ansley Hall is an all-women's residence, the first of its kind for Canadian universities. Ansley Hall offers single, double, and triple rooms. As well as being rich in history, the library at Ansley Hall provides a fantastic space for quiet studying when you don't feel like leaving your residence building. Royal Jackman Hall, or as it's commonly known as RJ, is Victoria College's apartment-style res. It's very popular among upper-year students. RJ offers the most independent style living at res. There are four to eight people in each suite. They come with one to two bathrooms as well as storage space and a communal kitchen. There's parking in the basement and laundry on the first floor. From academic advisors to residence buildings to co-curricular activities, Vic truly has it all.